connect info systems and today we'll see how we can write scss in udu so first we'll create a custom theme for our udu website and you can either do this by extending a theme or create a new one from the scratch now inside your module create a directory in static src cs this is the convention to create a css file or a css file and this is how my manifest looks now let's see how we can write the scss code so let's move to the code define variables so this is how you can define variables in the scss i have defined two variables primary color and secondary color and assign the value to them and let's use them so in theme heading h1 i will pass in the color and assign my variable secondary color to it let's reload the page so this is the color now let's change it to primary color and this is the color i have assigned let's see how this is and yes as you can see the color has now changed from black to brown now let's see how we can use mixin and define in scss so mixin is actually a css code that we can implement in the scss easily so this is how we define mixin we create button styles with two variables and then assign the properties and this is how we are using mixin in the button primary i have included my styling and pass the variable bg color and text color let's see how it is so this is my button read more and i have assigned the color to it now let's change its color now i change the background color so let's replace this with this my primary color and let's reload the page and yes the color has now changed now i change the font text color let's change it from white to hash 000 let's reload and as you can see the color has now changed now i am adding hover effect let's see how it changes when you hover on the button so and colon hover let's change the background color to hash 000 and the color to hash fff let's reload the page and see how this is as you can see it is working on the hover effect 